I'm Dan Ackerman, senior editor at CNET.com, and we are here taking a look at the laptop of the moment, Lenovo's ThinkPad X300. Now, there's been a lot of ink and a lot of buzz about this guy. It's a thin and light reworking of the ThinkPad brand, and people have really been comparing it to the Apple MacBook Air, another thin and light 13-inch laptop. It weighs about three pounds. It's pretty much the same as the Air, although you do get three USB ports here and an optical drive, although you still don't get an SD card slot or an expansion card slot. But a lot of the extras that you're going to want are already built in, like wireless broadband, uh, wireless USB, and even GPS. Like the Air, one of the highlights is the 64 gig solid state hard drive. These, of course, help with heat and weight, but they'll add about $1,000 to the price of your laptop. For a 13-inch laptop, the keyboard is large and generous, definitely a plus in a business-minded system. Uh, you can tell it's a ThinkPad because besides the regular touchpad, they keep the little red pointing stick and the extra set of mouse buttons that go along with that uh, because Lenovo was kind of redesigning the whole ThinkPad line and trying to make it uh, cleaner and smaller. You would think it would be time to retire that, but I know it has its fans. Of course, people have been talking about how thin and light this laptop is, and it's certainly no heifer, but the display is a little bit thicker than we've seen on some other laptops recently, and it's actually got this weird overhanging bezel right here that uh, makes it feel a little chunkier. So despite the comparisons to the MacBook Air, when you look at the two systems side by side, you can see there's actually a pretty big difference in how thick they are. A more apt comparison might be the original MacBook, which is a pretty good dead ringer for the X300 in both size and thickness. I'm Dan Ackerman, and that is the Lenovo ThinkPad X300.